Something I always swear by is to always look behind you. I absolutely love it when a plan comes together. Mid-October, shouldn't be snowing right now. Wow! Look at this for an autumnal view. My first sunrise shoot of my trip began at 5.30 a.m. and I headed back to a spot I'd visited before in search of some awesome sunlight. Sturgeon Lighthouse is located on the east side of Door County and has a Coast Guard base right next door. As I ventured closer to my destination, I noticed some lovely light brewing in the distance, so I packed up my gear and headed into the light. My first dawn shoot here in the US and I've come to a place that I've been to before when I last visited. Um, it's called Sturgeon Bay and the Sturgeon Point and there's a lighthouse here. It's a very distinctive lighthouse. It's painted red. It's not typically your lighthouse uh, shape you'd normally uh, associate with. But it has as well then a sequence of um, grid structures that lead directly out to the lighthouse which I think are really nice as well also. But I've come here for um, sunrise and the sun is due to rise in around about 15 minutes. We're getting some nice pre-dawn light here as well at the moment. The conditions are okay. There's a lot of cloud on the horizon. There is a tiny little gap on the uh, horizon, which I do hope that the sun will come up through. If it does, it will light everything that we have here around us up absolutely beautifully. Um, I'm going to take a couple of shots here pre-dawn, so in the blue hour, just to see what type of uh, composition I can get. It is quite dark here. That camera uh, won't really show you how dark it is, but it is uh, quite dark. So I'm going to get a couple of photographs here. And I'll check back in again, uh, just as the sunrise is about to happen. Something I always swear by is to always look behind you. So um, sunlight obviously is coming up from this direction here, but it's facing this way. And as you can see in the background here, we have another uh, lighthouse, a more traditional lighthouse. It's not what I came to shoot because the um, it's not really difficult. So there's no real composition that you can take except when you're shooting back in. And then obviously the sunlight is going to be coming from this side here. But as you can see, there's some lovely purple pink uh, hues that are appearing above it and with the conditions that we have right now I do think it's going to be uh, a nice shot for me to get just before the sunrise will pop up over on the far horizon and with the pastel colors that we have here it's a nice calm and serene um, 
positioning based on the, the jetty that I'm on here, it really does protect against the prevailing waves that are coming from uh, this side over here and it's quite flat calm. And when we're looking here then with those lovely colors and the nice touch of clouds as well that are there, I think that's gonna be uh, a, a nice shot actually, just while I'm waiting for the sun itself to come up. So um, I can see a bright crimson red color now just appearing on the horizon. So that tells me the sun is not that far away. So I'm going to go back to where I was again now and uh, I'll show you what I'm looking at here from the sunrise point of view. I had hope that the sun was going to pop up right on the gap and horizon and it actually has, which has been amazing. Um, so you can see it here now, it's just popping up through the gap to the left of my camera. And what that's going to do is give me a nice bit of a focal point in the shot as well itself. If I was on the other side over here, you'd see the red of the lighthouse being lit up obviously by the direct light, but I can't get to there, I'm where I am at the moment. But I think it's going to be uh, nice. There's not many clouds above us, but it's still I'm going to get some nice um, uh, direct light obviously coming from the sun there so good to see that planning will actually come through and uh, I'm going to get the shot here now and I'll check back in again in a moment. I'm back shooting in the opposite direction now again because as you can see here the light once it came up over here it started to catch the clouds that are behind this other uh, lighthouse which is actually a US uh, naval base and I can't get to it I can't get to this side either on the other area here because there's another jetty over here um, but I think actually this is uh, a very nice shot the water here is much calmer like I said earlier on versus on the other side and I don't need to have any sort of a long exposure or anything like that now as well it just allows me to be able to get the shot I'm going to uh, quickly now change uh, I might just do it now I'm going to quickly change my composition and I'm going to go to a portrait mode and the reason I want to go for a portrait mode is because the water itself is calm I can see that there's a bit of a reflection uh, appearing in the uh, of the lighthouse itself so I'm going to see if I can try and capture that uh, in the shot so I'm just going to set it up here now it's very simple I'm at half a second I'm at uh, f18 and I'm going to grab that shot before the light is gone focus on the lighthouse simple The sun is up now and it's lighting up the sky behind the lighthouse itself so I've come to the very very end of the pier or the jetty to be able to shoot the lighthouse here from the side it is going to be a nice shot I do think difficult as always to expose because the sunlight is coming from behind it but uh, right now I can see that the light is coming through the top part of the glass as well on the lighthouse so I'm using my um, remote so I don't have to touch the camera but yeah a lovely morning no major explosion of light but I do like what I got in the opposite direction and it's something that you know I generally try and do but today was a perfect example of why you should do that is always look behind you you'll never know where the light is going to be uh, at and it could light something else up that you would miss unless you actually are conscious of that so um, I'm going to finish up this morning shoot it's great to get out in the morning here in Wisconsin the conditions were cold but not overly cold I have my gloves on but 
um, you know it was around maybe minus one or something like that so it wasn't overly cold but I'm happy with the shots that I've gotten here uh, I'm gonna take one or two more but for now I'm gonna sign out of this episode of my vlog thank you very much as always for tuning in I do hope you enjoyed the content um, if you do like the content and your first time on the channel please do hit that subscribe button leave me a like and a comment and until the next time stronger folk